All right, welcome back to another tutorial in DaVinci Resolve. This is our quick tutorials. Um, so let's jump right into it. Without further ado, we're gonna get into bands and why you should use them. All right, so back to the basics, basically. So we are in the media page. Um, as you can tell, I have a lot of different files inside of my uh, media page or, you know, file folders. And the reason why I do this is so that everything is nice and neat. And when you have uh, multiple timelines and when you have uh, tons and tons and tons, like as you see video footage, it's easier to it's easier to just kind of throw everything together, but then the problem with that is as you search for different things, when you get deeper into a timeline, or if you're doing a, a let's say a, a podcast of some sort or, or a documentary, um, it may be difficult to find out, oh, I know this file was here, but I can't tell. So it just, this organizes everything for me. For me, I used to hate bins, but now I use them. So in my particular file, for this instance, it's my Vegas video that I shot. If you haven't seen it, check out the link below. Um, but for the Vegas video, I have the final videos because I went back and redid some uh, tutorials with them. And I also have like my logos, which is where I pop on my animations for the end credits and opening like you'll see on this video. And I have my R6 files. If I shot my C200, which I'm filming on right now, I would put that on. Basically, you just wanna have everything split up and you can do whatever you want in terms of the bins. And the easiest way to do it is you just right click right here and click new bin, very, very simple. You type in whatever you want, I'll just put that file and then I can very easily drag a file into there. It is that simple. Um, obviously, let's pull this back out. Uh, let's pull this back out to master. But it's very simple, as you see, to, to move files in and out between the, uh, the folders. Um, this just keeps it very, very easy. Like I said, with the uh, timelines, I have, uh, and I'll do this on another video, but um, to keep this one short, but I have multiple, multiple, multiple timelines where I'm doing comparison videos like you see, uh, where I'm doing the, um, the just regular B-roll footage where things are just kind of on this one frame. So um, as you start to dive into a deeper scale of DaVinci, this will matter probably a lot more than you think it will. Uh, but again, this is very, very simple. All you do is just right click, do new bin. And of course, if you want to rename it, you right click again and it shows rename bin right here. You can remove it, you can delete it, you can drag and drop. It is very, very simple, but please get used to bins because it makes a it basically takes away a massive headache once you start having so, so many files. So that is it for this video. Just want to jump right into it and thanks for watching another quick edit. See you guys later.